Hello, it's Miss Nicole from the South Fanton Bridgeville Libraries, and I'm here today to give you another kindergarten readiness tip. Today, we're going to talk about following two or three step directions. It's very important in kindergarten that you listen to what your teacher is telling you to do and then do it. Also, you've been listening to one step directions for a long time. Maybe you heard your preschool teacher say, please sit crisscross applesauce, and you would do that. But it's even better if you can listen to two part directions, two steps. Maybe your teacher's gonna say, sit crisscross applesauce and put your spoon, your hands in your lap. So that's two things that you can hear. You can practice two step directions by playing Simon Says. That's a lot of fun. You could have your grown up say, Simon says, jump up and down and shout hooray. So you jump up and down and you shout hooray. Maybe your grown up tells you to hop on one foot and clap your hands. So you would hop on one foot and clap your hands. What if they said, touch your nose and say, wowee? Touch your nose and say, wow, wait, well, Simon didn't say. So now you have to listen very carefully. Does Simon say, touch your nose and shout, wow, we? Yes, touch your nose and shout, wow, we. But when you get to kindergarten, you might even have to know three part directions. When I used to teach kindergarten and I would work with groups, that means that I was working with one group and I wasn't supposed to be interrupted. All the other kids were going to work in their groups and I would give them little directions made on paper. This one tells them they have to first cut. So I put scissors and the word cut. Then use your glue stick to glue what you cut and then use your crayon to color. So I would often put these up by the stations that they had to go to. When you're at home, maybe your grown-up can make e an easy one of these. You could do at nighttime, put on your PJs by yourself, go brush your teeth by yourself, and pick out a book. So that's a three-part direction that your grown-up needs to tell you to do. And this is a nice visual reminder of how to do that at night. Maybe you can hang it um, by your bedroom door. Maybe even when you um, are getting ready to go out with your grown-up, they tell you, put your shoes on, get your coat on, and go to the car. Three step directions. You have to listen. What do I have to do first? Shoes, coat, car. And this could be by your front door. You can do this for all kinds of things. Um, even whenever you come home from school, what does your family want you to do? Put your book bag in its spot, hang up your coat, and go get a snack. Whatever you do. So you need to practice listening, paying attention, and doing it so you'll be ready for kindergarten. Bye-bye.